Hey Java developers, virtual threads are now a final feature in Java 21. Let's take a look at what virtual threads means for Java. Threads are the means by which all code is executed on the JVM. Every statement and method is executed in a thread. Historically, threads in Java have been a relatively expensive resource, as they typically mapped one-to-one -to, -one to threads supplied by the operating system. For applications needing only a couple of dozen threads, this wouldn't represent a major issue but threads are a finite resource. And web applications, which often have a thread per request model, could use up available threads relatively quickly. This wouldn't necessarily be a problem if threads were being highly utilized. However, the reality is that threads can spend a lot of time idling while waiting for a response back from an external services like a database or web service. Zooming out and looking at this from the whole JVM perspective, a significant amount of time could be spent idling, leading to low CPU utilization despite all available threads being consumed. To address this, Project Loom split threads into two distinct concepts, platform threads, implementations of Java link thread, that are a wrapper of the thread provided by the OS, and virtual threads, also implementing Java link thread, which exist only in memory and run on top of platform threads. With virtual threads existing only in memory, taking up a few kilobytes, and having near instantaneous initialization, there is not a meaningful limit on the number of virtual threads a Java application can use. The scheduling of virtual threads is handled by the JDK, placing virtual threads on available platform threads, parking a thread when it encounters a blocking operation, and taking a parked thread off the queue to run it on the freed up platform thread, and eventually unparking the virtual thread to run it again when it receives a response. Virtual threads are not tied to a specific platform thread and are free to move to whichever platform thread is available. The context of the thread, stack, thread local variables, etc., are part of the virtual thread and so travel with the virtual thread regardless of the platform thread it is on which keeps the process of writing and debugging applications in the same blocking and imperative programming style Java developers are familiar with. Happy coding!